Welcome to Aptitude Destination. Please pause the video and read the question completely. We have to consider a three digit number and we are supposed to find what number it is. Statement 1 says the sum of the digits of the number is equal to the product of the digits. Now, this is a very commonly tested proof in many competitive exams. The sum of the digits is equal to the product of the digits is always 1, 2, and 3. When you add 1, 2, and 3, you will get 6, and when you multiply 1, 2, and 3, you will also get 6. If we are considering non-zero digits, these are the only three numbers that will satisfy this condition, so it's better to remember them for any competitive exam. Now, the three digit numbers that are possible with these three digits would be 123, 132, 213, 231, 321, and 312. Therefore, statement 1 alone is not sufficient to answer this question. Statement 2 says the number is divisible by the sum of the digits of the number. We know that the sum of the digits of the number is 6. And for a number to be divisible by 6, it has to be an even number because 6 is also an even number. The only two even numbers in our case are 132 and 312. Dividing 132 by 6, we get 22. Therefore, 132 is a multiple of 6. Dividing 312 by 6, we get 52. Therefore, 312 is also a multiple of 6. So even with statements 1 and 2, we are not able to answer this question. Therefore, option D is the right answer.